Hello everyone and welcome back to Coloring with Haley. Today I have a sticky pack for you. This is my second take trying to record this because my camera said it had 35 minutes left and then died about two minutes into the filming. So this is my second take filming this cute pack for January. I did skip December because sticky does allow you to skip a month if you need to or if you don't like the designs, which I really appreciate. So this month's theme is love 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 as you can see here so we've got a valentine's day theme which is really nice i like that they send these out about a month early because they do tend to ship on the 11th so if they send you this in february you may not get the package before it's valentine's day and then you wouldn't be able to use some of the stuff in here so to start out they have sent us a stamp again it's been a while since we received a stamp but it is this little bird stamp here, and I'm going to stamp this onto some scratch paper to make it easier to see. Uh, this is a Sticky Club original, it would seem, because it does not have an artist. Let me get my ink pad and piece of paper here. And I like these stamps from Sticky. They do work very nicely. I'm very happy to see them sending stamps out again. All right. I think I've got this fairly coated with ink, but we'll see. This one's a little bit more delicate than the other ones. Uh, it's got a lot more fine lines. Well, we'll see if I got it though. Yeah, there we go. And that's super cute, there you go. It's a little bird with a love letter and it's got its package of mail right there. So that is our stamp for this month, and I'm just going to set the stamp aside to dry. Now my only problem with it is, of course, since it is flat paper, flat plastic, not paper, you do sometimes get ink on the side there that you'll need to kind of clean off because it doesn't really want to dry on the slick plastic. So next up, down here is where we usually get our notepad, but this month we have a letter set. So you get two envelopes and two little pieces of like cardstock that look like chocolate bars, front and back. So you could write on whichever side you want. And I'm not sure if this is a printing error on mine or if that's supposed to be there. But these are really cute. Sticky original, I assume, because there is no artist on here. But these are really nice, so you can make Valentine's Day cards and send these to your friends. So let me put these back in here, and then we'll have a look at all of the stickers for this month. So, you're going to see a sticker set, and you're going to know why I picked the cute pack right away, I think. Let me set this to the side. Okay, so... Our first set of stickers is clear, so I'm going to flip a sheet over so that you can see them better. Here we go. So this is by Enio, is how I would pronounce that. Uh, and I, I don't think there is a link to a website here. I don't think it tells your website where you can see this artist. But it's this really cute clear backed sticker set with this really cute like little poodle celebrating Valentine's Day. I like this Cupid one here. And I love this one down here where the dog is in the letter set. That's really cute. And then you also get lots of little hearts and letters and pink confetti and just all kinds of stuff. So this one is really, really cute. And next up is also another clear one. These are very 3D, kind of like puffy stickers, but not soft like puffy stickers. They are hard. This is a sticky original, and I believe it's a bunch of cupcakes, although, like, this one to me says more like ice cream cone than cupcake. Same with, like, this one here. So I guess we'll just say they are a bunch of different desserts. And you get a ton of them. I don't think there are any repeats. I think these are all different. They all look different. So there's that one. And then we have another clear one. And these are very light. They're very pastel. 
I see that they are not showing up too well on my camera, but they are also glittery. But this is another sticky original, it seems, and they are just cute little animals. There's a rabbit, there's like a, maybe a sheep and a bear, a little dog. There's a bear and another rabbit, another rabbit. Yeah, they're just Valentine's Day themed. You got like your conversation hearts. I'm sorry if these are really hard to see, but they are, they are very, very light in color and they're a little bit hard to see in person too. So there's that one. And then we have this regular white backed set. These are really cute. These are by M. Ginny Illustrations. And you can go to Ginny Illustrations on Instagram if I could get this to focus a little bit. There we go. You can go to Ginny Illustrations on Instagram. And these are really cute. They say BFF and you get this little squirrel here and this little cat character. And these look like little photos that they've taken together, like in a photo booth or something because they've been edited. And of course, Doug isn't here right now, but I don't read the Japanese kanji, so I cannot tell you what this says. Um, but I will ask him when I upload the video, and I will put it in the description what that says, and what the little squirrel is saying down here as well. I'll have him translate that for us. Because I'm not too sure what they are saying. Alright, so next is the one that gives away why I wanted this set. These are by... Moon Spice? Moon Spice? They have a website and an Instagram. And these are really cute little Valentine's Day frogs. I love these so much. Just doing all kinds of different Valentine's Day things. A bunch of conversation hearts. He's Cupid. He's got a rose on his back here. Well, he does in all the photos, actually. I just noticed that. Yeah, he's really cute. There he is with a, like a gift box of chocolates. There he is in the letter set. And a flower with the balloons. Yeah, this is definitely why I picked this pack this month. I really liked this frog sticker sheet and I wanted it so bad. Next up, we have another sticky original that is on clear plastic. And these are just little letters, uh, but they go in a nice rainbow, so really like how these look. You could do a lot with these in a journal or a planner, I think. And they are shiny there in the middle where that heart like seal is on the letter. It's kind of a rainbow effect. Which I think is really cool. But a sticky original there. And then we have these. They are glittery. And these are by Rosupoku. You can see their Instagram there. These have a really nice grainy feel to them, I think because of the glitter. It's a very fine glitter, so I'm not really sure if it'll show up on camera. But they are definitely glittery in person. And it's a little bear and a little bunny. But this one looks more like it's focused on like heartbreak rather than being in love, because there's the bunny crying, and of course there's a big broken heart down here, and there's the bear crying. It's got tissues, they say no tears left. This one is still really cute. I really like this one. Love the bear with the food up there. And then we have one more clear backed one, so I'm going to turn this over. And it's another Sticky Club original. This one is a bunch of hearts in different colors with different things inside them. And these have the same kind of grainy feel because they are glittery. And again, it's a very fine, like, dust of glitter. So I'm not sure that it'll show up on camera. You could maybe write on these because they do feel very papery, so you could maybe write something in the center of these hearts. They are pretty big. And they are very light in color. Well, most of them, except for that one and that one. You could probably get away with writing some text in these. But again, these are nice for Valentine's Day, so we'll lay out everything you get in here. You get six seven sticker sheets this month. We get our little bird stamp here. And then we get our letter set for Valentine's Day. 
So that is everything that came in the January Sticky Cute Pack. Love, love, love. Thank you guys so much for watching.